So for your Friday as a whole, 45 degrees at noon, 48 at four. All of us staying and hovering between the lower to upper 40s today, gaining more and more of that cloud cover and working into the rainfall as we head into the afternoon and evening. Overnight tonight, we keep with the rain scattered to uh, more widespread showers, mostly cloudy conditions, temperatures then dipping back into the upper 30s. Of course, though, the countdown continues to spring now. Only two more days. It arrives on Sunday at 1133. And once we get to our first official day of spring, it definitely will feel like it. We just have to deal with this rainfall until uh, we get there. So the scattered rain will continue into the first half of your Saturday. By Saturday, say 3, 4 o'clock, things start to push towards the east side of the state. We'll dry out, remain with some cloud cover, and then high pressure starts to move in. That's going to wipe away all that cloud cover and give us this beautiful end to the weekend for your first official day of spring on Sunday, so not bad. Here's the next couple of days though on your super seven day planner. 48 today, 44 tomorrow. Yes, it's cooler, but pretty seasonal temperature wise for this time of year. How much rain are we talking though? Think about a half an inch to an inch of rainfall, higher totals as you travel southward, but this is over the course of today and tomorrow. So kind of a widespread event here for not a, a huge heavy hitting amount of rain. There's that first official day of spring, 54 degrees, plenty of sunshine on Sunday, even warmer on Monday with 60 in sun. And then next week we'll flirt between the 50s and 40s with our next rain chance arriving Tuesday overnight into Wednesday.